Let's look at the basic traffic shaping policy on 40 OS 7. All right, so uh, you'll find traffic shaping on policy and objects traffic shaping the same as you did in earlier versions, but now the workflow is based on a more straight to the point, a tab based workflow where you create your shaper, create your policy, and you can also create traffic shaping profiles, which we will not do this time. All right, so let's create a new shaper. We will choose a pair IP shaper. We will aim it on a specific IP address. Let's name our shaper limit bandwidth and let's set the maximum bandwidth to four megabits. Okay. Now, the second thing that we will do, but before we'll do it, let's just move to our specific device, which is my Ubuntu device, and let's run the fast.com speed test to see how fast is our, our connection right now. So fast.com, and we're getting 50, 63 megabits. Okay, 68, all right. Now let's move back to my 48, and now let's move to traffic shaping policies, create new policy. Let's name our policy Ubuntu, and let's set the source to our um, Ubuntu device. Destination will be all, service will be all. We will not choose application or URL category, we will use the outgoing interface, which is our WAN interface, and a pair IP shaper. Let's choose our shaper. Our shaper is limit bandwidth, which currently uh, is up to four megabits uh, bandwidth. All right. So we have our traffic shaping policy. Let's move back to our Ubuntu device. Let's refresh the page. And we can see that we're not getting more than four megabits. Let's just refresh the page again to see that we are actually set to that limit. And yep, we are limited to up to four megabits per second. 